So we're getting Lego Baby Yoda brickheads now. And by the way, this before we've had even a rumor about a minifigure scale version coming out. So I suspect that the Lego design team did not successfully gauge the popularity of the character and the minifigure design team needed some extra time to work on their version. So they turned to the brickheads team and went, hey, you, you put out some Baby Yoda toys while we get this design settled out. And to be honest, I have nothing bad to say here. Baby Yoda looks adorable. This is what I call a perfect brickhead. He's cute, he's adorable, he fits the brickhead styling, but it's still faithful and accurate to the on-screen version. This is one of the best translations from screen to brickhead form that I've seen um, ever, really, in the entire theme's uh, life span. But its cot, on the other hand, leaves some stuff to be desired. I mean, the colour's nice, but let's, let's all be honest, that doesn't look remotely round or, you know, boorish. It looks quite, quite awfully blocky, in my opinion. But that's easily, that can be easily modded, so it's not that big of a deal. Plus, it's Baby Yoda, so he gets the Get Out Jail free card automatically. The Mandalorian, on the other hand, looks perfect too. He looks very clean and polished, which is uh, which is what I like. I like my Lego being smooth and tiled out, so it fits my uh, personal tastes. And I really appreciate the brick built armor detailing on his chest. It's such a breath of fresh air after Lego has started uh, kind of abusing uh, the printed chest plates. Um, last year with the brickhead theme and the brick build belt looks perfect as well nothing bad to say here of all this is a day one purchase it's a must buy i'll be there lining up at the lego store even before it's open that is if the coronavirus doesn't get me first so that's it for this video hope you enjoy it please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one